an alternating current of omega, uh, angular frequency. Uh, okay, angular frequency is uh, this one should be the radian per second. Angular frequency. This is the uh, this is the omega. Yeah, this is the omega. Flows through a 10 kilo ohm resistor. Okay, 10 kilo ohm resistor. So you have resistance here. And uh, 0.1 microfarad capacitor. Okay, so you have capacitor here. Uh, this is the capacitance C. Okay, uh, which are connected in series. Okay, series. Uh. So this is a RC uh, circuit. This is a RC circuit. Yeah, uh, uh, combination of resistor and capacitor. So now calculate the root mean square voltage root mean square voltage across the capacitor. Oh, so and if given root mean square voltage across uh, resistor is 20 volt. Okay. So he asked to find the um, he asked to find the uh, V sorry. He asked to find the VRMS uh, C, uh, VRMS C, uh, and given here 20 volt is uh, VRMS uh, resistor. Okay, so he asked to find VRMS C, uh, this one. Okay, VRMS. Um, this is the uh, for the for the capacitor. So uh, he asked to find the V the root mean square voltage for the capacitor. Okay, so the information recorded here, we have the angular frequency, uh, we have the resistor, okay, resistor in kilo ohm, so make sure you change to SI unit, uh, kilo exponent 3, and then capacitor also given in microfarad, change to exponent negative 6, alright, uh, okay, and then he give the root mean square voltage for resistor 20 volt and asking for root mean square voltage of the capacitor and this is a RC circuit we must identify always identify the type of circuit first huh? so this is a RC circuit only two component resistor and capacitor so uh, this is the uh, this is the arrangement uh, resistor and capacitor in series okay uh, since resistor and capacitor in series uh, we also can say the current root mean square current is the same for both, yeah, because only one circuit, uh, only one circuit. So the current root mean square current is the same for both component. For both the root mean square current is the same for resistor, also same for uh, capacitor. Okay, uh, so uh, we we have given uh, it has given the root mean square. Voltage for resistor 20 volt, asking for root mean square uh, uh, voltage for capacitor. Okay, remember uh, because in series same current IRMS passes through both resistor and capacitor. Okay, so how to find? We have the root mean square voltage root mean square voltage for resistor. So how to find the root mean square voltage for capacitor? So first of all, we can find the root mean square current uh, find the root mean square current by using the formula uh, VRMS uh, VRMS uh, okay VRMS R equal to I RMS when RMS voltage so current also RMS okay VR so IR uh, okay uh, so uh, put in the 20 volt uh, root mean square current resistor is uh, 10 kilo ohm which is 10 exponent 3 uh, ohm so the root mean square current we get is um, 2 exponent negative 3 ampere yes that's the answer uh, for root mean square current and the, the root mean square current is the same for both resistor and capacitor because they are in series uh, same current passes through both of them so now we can find the root mean square voltage for capacitor uh, 
uh, because we already have the current VRMSC equal to IRMSXC. Uh, VRMSR equal to IRMSR, VRMSC equal to IRMSXC. Okay, so we or we okay. We need to find the XC. Yeah, uh, we need to find the XC. We don't have XC, but we have C. We have capacitance. Okay, so how to find? So uh, XC is equal to one over omega C. Uh, this is the formula. And we already have the omega. Omega is uh, 1 exponent 4. Okay, so 1 exponent 4 radian per second times the capacitance which is 0 0.10 exponent negative 6. Uh, okay, uh, this is the one, yeah? Uh, so the, cap the, the reactance we get is 1000 ohm. Okay, 1000 ohm. So now, we already got XC, we can substitute, uh, okay, IRMS is 2 exponent negative 3, XC is uh, 1000, so we get uh, 2 volt, uh, because uh, this, and, this and, and this one cancel off, get 2 volt. So VRMS C is 2 volt, and the current IRMS is the same for both. Because they are in RC in series. Okay, so the answer is 2 volt.